Have you done this here? I haven't, do I haven't done this. Yeah. <laughs> Hotel room. We walked without talking at all. No, don't God. stick it. Don't stick me. You know. Care PC. I'm not gonna lie, I'm absolutely steaming. He's probably saying to him, just give him extra chips. Just give him extra chips. Just give me a water, mate. Give me a water. Hug my man. Oh, beautiful, mate. Beautiful, thank you very much, mate. Cheers, buddy. Thank you. Kebab, pizza, fried chicken. He brings over some gravy. There it is, bit of gravy. I'm thinking, why are you bringing over gravy? I've already. I've already knocked in your garlic sauce, I've already knocked in your barbecue sauce, and then I see why he's bringing gravy. Oh my god. Proper KFC gravy. Bang. So then you've got places like Mr. Pasta, recommended many, many times, but I still haven't been. And you keep walking up past the casino, there's restaurants on the right of you. Restaurants on the left, including Asian kitchen, and then people casually jogging past. And that is American Indian Cafe. This is where I'm sat now. Yeah, the bacon and sausage is definitely not not doing it for me here. Big, big croissant as well. Eh? <laughs> Thank you very much, mate. Right then, so I've came for a full English breakfast now at American Indian Cafe, just on the um, the beachfront of Porta del Carmen here in Lanzarote. I've actually ordered two breakfasts because I went to order a coffee and I seen a sign saying coffee and a croissant for three euros. The croissant is massive. Size of that croissant. But separate to that, I also got a full English breakfast for 375. But I'm gonna show you what's been served to me and see what you think. Nice and cheap, 375. So you've got half a tomato, grilled tomato, sausage, one egg, beans, one bacon, um, toast, might even be fried bread that, it is fried bread. One hash brown. Then I've got the coffee which came with a croissant. So the coffee and the croissant was three euros, the breakfast was 375. All together, 675, I think it's an absolute steal. First I'm gonna get stuck into the, the bacon which, you can tell it's pan fried, lots of fat, it's quite a big piece of bacon. One side looks cooked a lot, the other side looks undercooked. Let's give it a go. Very, very chewy. Very strange bacon, that. No saltiness to it at all. No real flavor. And the sausage, like most places when you go abroad, um, it's a really cheap sausage. Low meat content, but I don't mind Aldi sausages as they're essential sausages where they've got about 15% meat. The hash brown looks nicely cooked. And it is. The egg white is nice and thick. Thick, cooked well. Let's try that on some of the fried bread. You know, it's a, it's a cheap breakfast, isn't it? It's 375. And that is American Indian Cafe. This is where I'm sat now. Yeah, the bacon and sausage is definitely not, not doing it for me here. So finally at 12 o'clock, the clouds are moving, the sun's come out, and now it's getting warm again. So now I'm full up off breakfast at the American Indian Cafe. Nice and cheap. I'm gonna work my way down beachfront to Sun Lounge for a one euro pint. If I see anywhere on the way, you know, there's a lot of places selling pints at 150. I might stop at one of them, sit down, have a drink, and relax in the sun. Nice little stroll along the beach. Very close to the sea. But I, when I travel light, I haven't got any sandals with me. I'll just take my shoes off. I'll we'll splash around because it's now getting very warm. That wasn't too bad. Having the full pool area to myself. Sat sunbathing. I'm trying to top the tan up before I leave tomorrow. I'm not sure how much of that KBC order last night, kebab, pizza, chicken, that I got on this video, because I haven't watched it yet. KBC? I'm not gonna lie, I'm absolutely steaming. He's probably saying to him, just give him extra chips. Just give me a walk, mate. But I remember, I remember it was nice, and I remember I was steaming. And there it is. 
I remember the uh, the last time we came, me and Rochelle, and we ended up up there. Self service Chinese buffet. You know, it was twelve quid. It was all you can eat. The selection wasn't great. The food wasn't great, but it was all you can eat. Hello, Hello mate. It's all right. How you doing, buddy? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. So this is my last night in Lanzarote. So I won't be having a late one tonight. I'll be eating again. Uh, I just won't be having a late night. Right, so that's it. The time at Lanzarote, Playa del Carmen, uh, Porto del Carmen, has came to an end. I'm just leaving Hyde Park now, Hyde Park Residential. And I've came out to a beautiful rainbow. Cloudy, but look at that. The start of the rainbow is just over there. And all the way across, you've actually got a double rainbow over this side, look at that. The end of the rainbow here, and then a second rainbow. So I've ordered a taxi, it's coming now, and I'm going straight to the airport. Cheers for watching, um, whilst I've been in Lanzarote, and I'm sure I'll be back early next year. Cheers, everyone. <laughs> Hola. Hola. Airport, please. Okay. Gracias. Okay. Meet the yeah. drone. Let's go. <laughs> So as I'm in the, the taxi there, Rochelle's just rang me and said apparently it's a yellow weather warning back in the UK, in the north, so see if my flight is still running. Let's check the board. Newcastle, boarding 10.30, 42 to 43. Flight's still on, pass security and into duty free. Which you need to be careful on the duty free because when you go through and you get these kind of offers, they're still not as good as the likes of when the Tesco have on one litre bottles of Smirnoff. What is going on my hair? You got all the cigarettes, tobacco, a lot cheaper than the UK. But I don't smoke, so we don't buy none of them. So there's loads of free seats on this um, on this plane. So I'm actually meant to be somewhere at the back, some up, up there. But because I'm one of the last on, I've just jumped on this seat, which has got all three. All three available, nice, comfy, that'll do me, I'll stick my legs out, have a kip, and uh, enjoy the flight. Listen, a massive thanks for watching me, Dad Loves Food, on YouTube, or over on Facebook or TikTok, but whilst you're here, click that subscribe button, the bell, and subscribe to Dad Loves Food here on YouTube.